Good morning. Welcome to the Wednesday Daily Dose Devotion. In fact, welcome to July. Guess what? It's July, but God is still on the throne. He is still large and in charge. Hey, turn with me to Joshua chapter 3, verse 15. Joshua 3, 15. Check this out. God is about to lead His people, His beloved people, out of the desert and into the promised land. God is on the move and He's about to bless His people. So I imagine that the Lord has it all set up for His people. Everything is just going to go smoothly. Everything is going to be easy as they come out of the desert into the promised land. But check this out. Joshua 3.15 says this, Now the Jordan is at flood stage during the harvest. (laughs) I think this is significant. I think it's very significant that the Israelites were called to cross the Jordan River into the promised land when the river was at flood stage. You see, God could have chosen any time during the year, any time for His people to cross the river. Why not a drought season? Why not that season when when the river is just trickling along, where the Israelites could just tiptoe across? No. Joshua 3.15, now the Jordan is at flood stage all during harvest. You see, this is the most difficult and dangerous time to cross a river. If if you've never been around a river that was flooding, you got to know this, man. It can be a terrifying thing. One of my memories as a boy was a canoe trip that I took with my dad down a raging, swollen river. See, it was immediately following flash floods. And and at this time, as as we were going down this river, there were moments it was terrifying. We felt out of control because at times we really were out of control. It was dangerous, but it sure was fun. By the way, this is why men don't live as long as women. We kind of like danger a little bit too much sometimes. Anyway, so the Israelites... For the Israelites, the waters were rushing, and the river was at its widest, but it was harvest time. And this is often how it is with us, even. When it appears to be the most difficult time, that is when we're called to cross over and to take the land. This is when we're called to step out and and follow God into our calling. Why would God choose to call us, call us over when the things are dangerous, when the waters of life are rushing? Well, maybe because it requires faith. Maybe because it requires a total dependence on Him and He gets the glory. Now today, we see a whole lot of shaking, a lot of instability. Things are being shaken up. The world is confused in a state of panic. The river of life seems to be at flood stage, yet, church, it's harvest time. We're being called to cross over and take the land. Rest assured, we are called for such a time as this. The river is raging, but it's harvest time. Come on now, let's take the land. Well, God bless you on this Wednesday morning. I love you so much, and I just pray that we would all have eyes to see past the raging rivers, and into the harvest. God bless you.